Hi and welcome to Clapier. In this video, we will see how to create simple apps using spreadsheets, which can be useful if you maintain a database in spreadsheet and wish to turn them into apps and make use of Clapier's features. Let's say I have an employee MIS maintained in Google Sheets. Certain information about some employees are maintained here under their respective headers. I'll turn these columns into fields in an app in Clapier. First, I'll just download this file. Now I'll go to my dashboard in Clapier. And on the left panel, I'll click on More and select Create App from Excel. Once selected, a right-hand panel will appear where you can upload your Excel files. I'll just click on this and select the spreadsheet that I just downloaded. Then click on Upload and Create App. It'll automatically create the app as you can see over here. The app will also be available in your dashboard with the name of the app as downloaded. Once you click on your app, it'll take you directly to App Home, where the app is live and ready to use. You can see it has taken all the headers from the spreadsheet and turned them into fields in this app. This method also saves you time in case you have to add a lot of simple fields in your spreadsheet to be created. You can always go back to the design app and modify your app according to your requirements. You can either click on Add Field and add the extra necessary fields that you need or you can configure every block on the right hand panel. In this instance, it has turned every field into a single line text field, which you can find out by hovering your cursor over the question mark icon. Taking this example of employee MIS, let's say I need to capture KRAs of every employee, for which I would probably require a multi line text field to capture large texts, or to capture the date, and also have some drop downs or selectors. These fields can also be automatically detected if you have them in your spreadsheet and created. I'll go back to the spreadsheet and add some data to it. I have now added some data, the date, type, department and role. Now there are some criteria for these columns to turn into the fields other than the single line text field. For example, this column needs to be turned into a multi-line text field. This can only happen only if the character count of the data is more than 100. Similarly, if you need a date field in your app, it needs a standard date format. And if you require drop-downs or single selector fields, then you will need to turn the columns into drop-downs. And your data must contain different options. So I'll just turn these two columns into drop-downs. You can do the same in platforms such as Excel or WPS using the data validation feature. I'll just speed up this part of the video. I have now turned these two columns into drop downs. Do note, while you will be able to create apps from spreadsheets, however, currently you can only use simple data like this format with headers at the top and its corresponding data. There cannot be any merged data or any logic or conditions, etc. You will have to have a well-defined header at the top with some data for each column for the app to be created. I will now download this spreadsheet and go back to the Clapier dashboard. Click on More, select Create App from Excel and select the new spreadsheet. I'll go to App Home and you can see the earlier fields which were the single line text field and the newly added fields and we now have the date field, a single selector field, a drop down and a multi line text field. Now in my spreadsheet, I had turned the type and department columns into drop downs. However, over here, the department has turned into a drop down, whereas the type column has turned into a single selector. That is because in your spreadsheet, if you have five or more options, it turns the column into a drop down, whereas if it is up to four options, you will get a single selector field. Do note, currently these are the fields you will be able to get in your app when you turn your data from spreadsheet into a Clapia app. If you require other fields, you can contact us about it. If you want to upload all the data in your spreadsheet that you have maintained, you can do a bulk upload. All you have to do is go to the submissions tab and click on the bulk upload option and follow its steps. If you wish to know how to bulk upload data from your spreadsheets in detail, there is a separate video on that linked in the description. You will also be able to view the same app on the mobile app. All you'll have to do is download the Clapia app if you haven't already, either on Play Store or App Store. And the moment you download the app, it'll be live and ready to use. So let's have a look. Over here, you can see the mobile screen with the Clapia app downloaded on it. I click on the latest employee MIS app created from the Excel file. The app is live and ready to use. 
and make a quick submission just to test it out. I filled in some random details and I'll click on submit. Even in the mobile app, you will be able to view all your submissions. Other users given access to this app will also be able to submit data and can view their submissions if they have been given the appropriate access. Click on a submission to view all the details. So if you have any query on how to create an app from Excel files or any other feature in Clapia, you can always request support by clicking on the button over here or you can email us directly to support at clapia.com and we'll be happy to assist you. Thank you.